Hi there, it's David Geldart of Lumacrest Lighting Solutions. We are a premier provider of top quality LED lighting solutions and products since 2008. And today I'm going to talk about lamp-based types. Um, if you're new to LED lighting, new to lighting in general, you'll encounter different types of ways of connecting the lights into your sockets and that can be a little confusing too, so this is a basic video about the types of lamp bases you'll encounter. Here we have good old Edison bulb with an Edison screw base. And yes, he did invent the screw base as well, clever guy that he was. This is a medium base known as an E26, Edison 26, but this time it's not 26 eighths of an inch. What the heck is this? Well, for some reason, it's 26 millimeters. <laughs> I don't know why, but there you go. The bases are measured in millimeters. You may also find these in 27 millimeters, which are more common in Europe, but they also fit, they're interchangeable. So E26, E27, medium base, sometimes you will see that's the most common screw base that you will find. Now, uh, I said that we have smaller ones, we got bigger ones. So here's a next size down. This is an E17 base on one of our LED lights. Here's an E17 base on uh, an incandescent light. Um, you don't encounter these too often, but they are out there. Um, sometimes they're known as a Euro, Euro base or French base because uh, they're a little bit more common there. Um, and smaller than that and more common is the E12 base chandelier bulb. Uh, incandescent 40 watt chandelier bulb and our LED 5 watt chandelier bulb emitting the same light with compatible E12 bases. You may also find E11 bases, but again, they are compatible. Um, if you run into a situation where you've got a socket, which is an E26 or E27 socket, but you want to put this candelabra bulb in there, we have adapters that you can just put the light into there and screw that right into your socket. And of course, you can do that either with the halogen bulb, but we recommend, of course, doing it with an LED. And we have this odd looking creature here, which is an industrial type of light, which is an E39 or E40, also known as a mogul base. It's more for an industrial type of lighting. We won't talk about that too much. You probably won't find this um, too often unless you're into industrial lighting scenario, but uh, it's a gigantic screw base and um, it's out there too. Now, we have another beast here, which is the GU10 base. This is on an MR16 halogen bulb, and we have LED versions of these as well. So it's 16 eighths of an inch across, but 10 millimeter pin spacing. These big fat pins uh, indicate that it runs 120 volts and the GU5.3 which is pretty much the same light on the front, but with two different pins, MR16s both, but this runs 120 volts and this one runs 12 volts. There's a special reason for that, which I won't get into here, but they are not compatible in terms of the voltage. Um, however, you can take this and adapt it to a screw base because this is 120 volts and so is this. So um, if you have a screw base socket and a GU10 light, you can also use that in a screw base using this handy adapter, which we also do sell. And that's pretty much the things that you're going to encounter on an everyday basis of the types of lamp bases you'll encounter.